Hey, it's Orgamine. Welcome to Backpack Battles. We have this backpack where we can add stuff on. I'm assuming we go fight. This does 1 to 3 damage. Stamina of 1, accuracy 90%. So I have 12 gold right now, and I'm able to spend my money on anything. Every 5 seconds heal for 4 and regenerate 1 stamina. Unattacked, 30% chance to prevent 4 damage and remove stamina. Opponent misses attack, gain 2 damage for the next attack. On hit chance to gain inflict blind. Oh, that's really good actually. I might take that. Start a battle regeneration. Heal one per stack every two seconds. I'll take some regen and then what else can I get? Every four seconds gain armor. 30% chance to remove one vampirism. Oh, uh, sure. I'll take that. So let's start the battle. Okay. So I'm fighting against this person. It's an auto battler, so it happens on its own. Okay, I won the round. That's cool. So it's similar to Super Auto Pets and the one rap backpack hero game. If you know what that is. Okay, what is this? On hit, destroy four of each freeze slot in front block. I don't know what that does. I don't really know. Shop entered, gain one gold. You know what? Yeah. Let's go for that. Weapons gain plus one damage, sure. I'll do that. Let's reroll. Um, every 3.5 seconds, gain water. If you have at least one water, gain luck. Oh, that's mana. Sorry. Start a battle, inflict blind. Okay, that's actually very good. Uh, chance to inflict block, sure. So let's do this. I have five stamina, okay, so there we go, I attack. Okay, she's healing constantly, but I'm blinding her enough. So deals one damage per two stacks, but she is blind. So I guess this could, I could do a blind run. Gain more shield. Or I can buy more backpack slots. I'll buy more slots. What's this do? Cleanse a random debuff if you have at least if five luck. Um, fifty percent chance to gain in power. Um, no thanks. Whoa, what the hell? Start a battle, gain vampirism. On hit, convert one regeneration to vampirism. Maximum damage increase by one per vampirism. Vampirism heals one. Hit. HP per stack when hitting with a melee weapon. Wow, okay. Um, so how do I do that? How do I buy this? Can I sell stuff? I can sell stuff. Okay, good. This gives me regeneration. This doesn't matter. Let's do that. Let's pop that here. Wait, hold up, hold up. This is working. Put you here, put you there. There we go. So now I have vampirism, which is cool. I have essentially blinding and vampirism. Oh, that's a legendary. Okay, so I have three vampirism. I heal a bunch. Three per hit, okay. That's really good. So this uses how much stamina? One. I won though. What is this? I don't know what just happened. Torch. Um, what the hell even happened? I don't know what happened. Okay, every five seconds randomly gain 12 armor or two stamina, or, that's actually really good. Wow, I'm gonna sell this torch. How will I be able to, you know what? Putting it here is actually good. Hold up, I'll put it right here, right? And I'll slip flip that. Okay, so triggers 10% faster for each of those items. Stamina usage is still high. Item triggers faster what can I do there nothing really I don't have enough it did not mean to do that it's fine though stones above can be thrown repeatedly um, don't really have enough for anything else so I'll just stop okay this is an interesting build she is going spike build okay that is not good against my my health build. Uh oh. Nah, I lost. That was bad. Okay. Oh, two legendary items. And that. Okay. Every three seconds, items trigger five percent faster, up to four percent. Remove.
move one from your opponent every three seconds to trigger five percent faster. That seems good. Artifact Stone Cold can only be thrown once per battle. On hit, inflict three. Huh. All items trigger too slower. Okay. Huh. You know what I think I need to do? I think I need to get rid of you. I need to get you. Do that, right? And I can put you there. And I can put this here. I'd like to put it where, uh, you know, a weapon can actually use it, but that's fine. I can act. Honestly, I think I could put that there. Put you here and then put you there. There we go. Ooh, okay. Gain 55 armor, gain 2 for each holy item. Holy items are what exactly? Are you a holy item? No. I don't think I have any other holy items. Okay, that's a lot of damage. Another spike person, seriously. And I'm taking way too much damage. This is not good. Like this bird is doing good. So is this flute. They're both doing decent, but I only have one vampirism. Which is not good, obviously. Let's buy one of these, honestly. Add two backpack slots, sure. They trigger faster on the inside, that's something. This is cool, it's good. Gain. Spike on hit. Wait, this might actually be a good item. Like, imagine healing and spike. Huh. That might actually be very good. Wow. Didn't think of that. Okay, this is a spike build. That's... Man, I have three regen. But obviously this one has a lot more spike, so... Oh, this is exactly my build. Spike regen. Wow. But this person's is more powerful. But it doesn't... It's not gonna stop me from doing it, though. Hmm, what can I do? I think this item was good where it was. So I'm just going to figure out a way to put it in. Oh, Bloodthorn, what the hell is happening? These two work together, apparently. I don't really know why, but I guess they do. Add three black black slots. One max stamina. Um Sure, I'll take I'll take more luck as well. Luck is always good. I'll take another luck. Items trigger faster. Sure I'll make you trigger faster, why not, right? Okay. It's a very interesting build I have going. This one is even more interesting. Why do you have a giant slime? Item activation. Heal for nine. Oh, okay, that's pretty crazy. Three vampires, but I have so much poison. But I won anyways. That's cool. Choose one, and choose one carefully. You have 5% chance to resist debuffs for each nature item. Every gained opponent reaches 19, they take damage. Spike steal one damage. Spike gained. Inflict two. So when I gain spiked, where did my... Oh, Bloodthorn, what is this? On hit, convert one health into Vampirism and one into one Vampirism and Spike. Deals plus one damage per Spike and Vampirism. That's insane. They... What the hell? Weapons deal plus 30 crit chance per damage. They remove five on crit. Item activation, 40%. I don't really like that one. Start a battle, gain one mana and one health for each nature item. Five used here for five and cleanse for your debuffs. Slots marked with will become when the effect can be applied. So when I gain spike, it does good. And this one just gives regen, which is really nice actually. So how can I get how can I get the most out of this? I'm gonna put that there. Health drops below 70% gain. Luck. Empower and that. Okay. None of those are really that good, I would say. Add one backpack slot and gain block. Why not? That's really good, actually. Oh, another Hungry Blade. Can I do that? Can I get more than one? Is that allowed? 
I don't really see why not. Okay. Let's move everything up one, yeah? I don't actually know if that's a good idea. Either way, let's get two of those. Put that there. I think this might work. Wait, what? Put you there. This isn't doing anything. That's insane. I don't really want that, though. Let's battle and hope I don't die, huh? Okay. I hope this triggers twice. Does it? Oh, no, it's per attack, isn't it? Yeah, I think it is. Oh, yeah, so having two of these is really not that good. Every two seconds gain, depending on what you have, the least of, use health, give the weapon plus two damage. What the hell? That seems overpowered, actually. Let's definitely take that. That seems so good. I don't know why that would even be a thing, to be honest. That's so good. The gin lamp. Wow. Wow, that's so good. Okay, so I have a bunch of spike and a bunch of map prism, and it seems to be working really well. What does this do? Items trigger three percent faster. Either way, I think this is really good. I don't really like that. I don't like that. Lightsaber, use three, inflict seven. Ah, uh, no thanks. Start a battle, gain two map prism and twenty maximum health. Vampirism heals one health per stack when hitting with a melee weapon. That is insane. Well then. Oh, I can evolve those and make vampiric gloves. Wait a minute. Oh, that makes a little piggy. So these things can work together and evolve. I did not know that. So the, all, the, all three of those will evolve. Okay. I wish I knew that. But now I do, so it's good. I don't really like this. Well, I guess I'll get another one of these. And... That's fine. Do you think I can actually... Hold up. If I were to... No, I don't think it's possible. Wait, what am I trying to do again? I honestly don't know what I'm trying to do. Hold up. If I were to do that, does it work on both of them? I don't think so. It doesn't matter. I'm evolving three things. Next... What is this build? What the hell? Health drops below 15, and heal for 10, and cleanse for poison. So there's just a bunch of health potions. Not really the best strategy, but that's something. Okay, these are all gonna evolve. After 5 seconds. After 4 seconds, gain vampirism. Items trigger faster. That's insane, actually. Shop enter, gain one. Start a battle, gain two. Chance based effects are more. Hmm. That seems really good, actually. Shop enter, generate one low quality gemstone. None of these are good. Oh. Hold up. Can't I just, like. Is there no way for this to be in here? Hold up. How would I manage to put this in here? I don't know why I have two of these. I don't think I need two of them. Add four backpack slots. First potion inside. Consumed gain a random buff. I'm just taking it for the slots, to be honest. Every one second, remove one stamina from the enemy. Sure, why not? I don't know what that does, but sure. This is a very interesting game, actually. This is a lot of fun. I didn't expect this game to be so fun, but it is. 10, 11 rappers, damn, okay. Healing me a lot. A lot, a lot of spikes, too. Four spikes, five spikes. A lot of luck. Luck is great right now. Wow, this is working. I guess I'll take that, and then I'll put you down there. Uh, the rest of these are not really that good. Oh, blood amulet. Start a battle, gain two. I'm gonna have to reserve that one. Oh, I can get this. 
put you right there. I have a lot more room for stuff. So I can definitely put stuff there. What is that? Cover 15 health, this shield. So you have a very shield oriented build, okay. Interesting. Magic torch. I still won though. I'll take that. It's not the time for that. I would take one of these, but no thanks. I'll put you there, because why not, right? Okay. Is it by the power of capitalism? That's hilarious. Okay, this is a build. I'm kind of scared, because a lot of things are happening here. I don't know what that coffin thing is, but I'm being poisoned a lot right now. This is not good. Uh oh. Yeah, I lost. The poison beat me. Oh my gosh. I'm so close to winning, though. On hit, remove two, and from opponent. That is good, but is it worth it? Opponent health, 30% deal, 50% more damage. When it inflicts debuffs, gain shield. I guess I might as well do that. I don't know. What is this? Reflect two debuffs. Hatches after two rounds in your backpack. I wish I could get that, actually. It seems like so much fun. Oh, it actually evolves with something. But I don't have the money for it, though. Unfortunately. You know what? Screw it, I'm getting it. Where would I put it, though? There we go. So I just have a random dragon egg. Actually, let's put that there. Let's actually put you over here. Put you right here. There we go. I don't think I'm gonna win this battle, to be honest. Yeah, this is a build for sure, and I don't think I'm gonna win it. Yeah, a lot of mana going on. Okay. Yeah, I definitely lost. Well, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this a lot, because I did. This was actually so much fun.